It is a dreary one out there. It's warm. Uh, folks saying, are we going to melt a lot of the snow? We're going to melt some of it, but you know, it, it's like an ice sh chunk out there, so it's really going to have to warm up. And we need some sun. That will not be happening today. As you can see on the radar that we did have that band of snow and sleet move through early this morning. That is now pushed to the north and moving out of Green Bay and the Door Peninsula. Uh, some areas to the north of Milwaukee picked up a dusting to a half inch of snow, made the roads a little slippery this morning. Other than that, that is pretty much melted as the temperatures are warming up. Still, we're going to have this chance for some light rain and drizzle throughout the afternoon, and it should just be that. Very light and drizzle, more annoying than anything else. Temperatures 37 degrees, south wind is at 6 miles per hour. It will be cloudy for the rest of the day. 36 in West Bend, 37 in Sheboygan. So the areas that did pick up that light snow, as I mentioned, it is now above freezing and it is melting. 38 in Racine and Kenosha, almost 40 degrees there. There could be a 40 or two before it is all said and done. Winds out of the southeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Future forecast shows a huge blob of rain. It's not going to be that widespread, but you get the idea that there will be some rain showers around throughout the afternoon. Not everyone is going to see them. That will be the case as we get into the evening and the overnight hours. There will be sporadic rain showers, maybe a little heavier downpour at times in some locations. We're looking for about a quarter of an inch from now until tomorrow evening. So it's a prolonged event, going to be dreary, but it's going to be very, very light. So the day planner is shaping up like this. 37 degrees uh, by 3 o'clock, 36 by 7 o'clock, and as well by 10 o'clock this evening. Uh, so it's not going to really cool down all that much over the next, uh, I'd say, oh, let's say, 12 hours or so, even 24 hours, we are going to stay warm. You can see in Port Washington, a little bit of snow that they did have has now pretty much melted which is good news, but they got a little freshening of snow across the area. As I mentioned, rainfall totals from this, not a lot. We're looking anywhere from about a quarter to maybe a third of an inch before it is all said and done. The computer wants to do some certain things, but I don't want it to do it. There we go. Now you can see there's the quarter of an inch of rain. Not a lot out there. and It will be rain as temperatures will be above freezing as temperatures now are anywhere from 35 to 38 degrees. Almost 40 in Sturdivant and Caledonia. Light rain in Waterford as well as Union Grove. The Goddard gauge today, we're looking at about a three. Just a dreary day. It is mild, getting close to 40 degrees, but the light rain and the drizzle and the dampness will put a kind of a damper on it. 38 today, 40 tomorrow after a morning low of 35. So we will have the rain showers around tonight and tomorrow. 36 with some light snow during the day on Saturday. Still could see a couple of inches of snow Saturday night. I'm thinking about maybe two to maybe three inches of snow before the cold front gets here. And then it's chilly. 16 for sa Sunday morning before temperatures drop into the single digits. Wind chills below zero all day Sunday. Monday 14, Tuesday 12, and some light snow and 15 on Wednesday. You knew we were going to have some winter. You know it's going to be mild all the time. We're back up to